here are three black sheep games and franchises that deserve a little more love. What is the most synonymous gameplay that you could think of when you hear Star Fox? Polygonal space combat, right? Well, Star Fox Adventures decided to take the furry little fox into a different direction on the GameCube. Remove all the ships and put Fox McCloud in a 3D action adventure game with a stick and you get Star Fox Adventures. The game was honestly still really good, so I suggest trying it out. Dark Souls 2 will forever be the Dark Souls game that made the least sense. It was produced by notable not Miyazaki-san as he was working on Bloodborne at the time. Dark Souls 2 somehow managed to look worse than Dark Souls 1. The combat was incredibly slow and at the time of release, it felt like there was so much input delay in every single swing. It had the most bosses and the most awful bosses in the franchise, but it's still not that bad of a game. Where do I even begin with Majora's Mask? This is my favorite video game of all time. You could tell I love Legend of Zelda. It ventured so far from the groundwork laid out by Ocarina of Time with the macabre setting where the world is ending in three days. It forces you to manipulate time just to save the land of Termina. The setting was beautifully dark and incredibly sad. The side quests were some of my favorite in the franchise. The mask mechanics were wonderfully unique and the story as a whole was incredibly touching. An absolute must play for anyone who calls themselves a gamer, let alone a Zelda fan. Let us know down in the comments what are some black sheeps and franchises that you really enjoyed.